I don't know if you've known this, probably because I've never told you, but I think Batman vs. Superman sucks. I might make a whole video about this sometime later, but I want to get one thing off my chest right now. That being Ben Affleck's Batman voice. Tell me, do you bleed? You will. Seriously, no one's making fun of Ben Affleck's synthesized bat voice. Why would you want Batman to basically sound like a robot? Final fairy buffabar, final fairy buffabar, final fairy buffabar, final fairy buffabar. I mean, it's even more silly than Christian Bale's voice. Where is he? I don't know where he is. He found us. He must have friends. Friends? Hmm. What's this guy? Someone knows where he is. And everyone laughs at that. But that's the thing. Everyone laughs at Christian Bale's voice, but Ben Affleck gets a pass? I don't think so. Oh, I don't think so. Who? So, why is Batfleck's voice so stupid? Well, in my opinion, it's a pretty easy and cheap way to make Ben Affleck, who doesn't really fit as Batman, to be honest, to make him work, pretty much. And that leads to a major problem with Batman vs. Superman. Its aim is more about star power. Ben Affleck is Batman, that girl from the Fast and Furious is Wonder Woman. You get the idea. Whereas the Dark Knight trilogy had actors that really fit into their characters' roles. I mean, look at this picture. I don't see Christian Bale. I see Bruce Wayne. But in any case, what would my solution be for Batman's voice? Well, in my opinion, I would have him talk very quietly. Or better yet, not have him talk at all. Bear in mind, Batman is supposed to be like a ghost or phantom. He's supposed to appear out of nowhere and strike within, with no warning. Having him talk quietly would really enhance that. Or just have him be voiced by uh, Kevin Conroy. <laughs> I mean, yeah, he's pretty awesome as Batman. So, yeah, just have him do that. Anyway, I'm YJ Wolf, and this message will self-destruct. Yeah!